Hello everybody, my name is Maisie of the Maisie Network and it's nice to see you all. Mini failed, this queen will do better. So, in case you haven't noticed, we are playing... Wait for it, wait for it. Kingdom! It's a pretty good game. But let's get into it. So right now we have Spooky Bitch, and she is leading us onto the path of greatness. And first, we must build our home by lighting this fire with our magical money powers. You just kind of throw money at it, just like these people. Magic. And in order to be great at this game, we need money. C can you tell how important that is? It makes the world go round. And we need a builder. Because, you know, money can't buy everything. <laughs> um, if you guys haven't played uh, Kingdom, it's pretty much you just collect money and watch everybody do their own thing. Um, we got these rabbits here. And these rabbits spawn where these little green patches are right here. And we got some hobos out here, you know. We got those shanty towns. Or what are they called? Uh, Hoover towns, maybe? President Hoover? Something like that. <clears throat> Get us another boat. So this needy bitch. Ar oh. Hold your shit. Hold. Hold yourself, woman. They're coming. Look at them run. Look calm. Jesus. Well, pretty much the tutorial's done now. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, throw that coin at me, boy. Anyway, so tutorial's pretty much done. She wants to, uh, us to expand this middle area. Make our fire bigger. But we don't have money for that, so she can wait. Oh, she, she's gone. Eh. So, night time is a coming, or else we would be wandering off to do something. Look at this little guy. He got sweat on his brow. The bad part about this game is you do have to wait through the night. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. We can't speed up this night process. We got another hobo. Come, join me, hobo. I best know you're gonna give me that. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Alrighty. Anyway. Now we wait. It'll be nighttime of the first day. Do a little horse dance in between. Um, I'm gonna build this just in the case because I don't know which side the monsters are coming from. And if it's this side, then we're fucked. <gasps> it was this side. Oh, thank God. That be my coin. Anyway, so for anybody that doesn't know, this guy right here with the little ass beside him, he is the most important guy in this game. He gives you eight coins every morning as long as you give him one coin. Profit of seven coins, Jesus. So no matter what, always pay this guy. Always. And we survived. Let me give him his coin. Yes. Alright. So we know for a fact that the monsters come from that direction. 
Now, this is the first world, so monsters can only come from that direction. So, it's safe to say that we can explore the left side of the area without being harmed. And we should get another builder too. Beautiful. Look at look at this. It's like an owl or some sheet. Alrighty. Onward. So what we need to do in order to get some more money coming in is try and get rid of these trees. Since there's no settlers or um, merchants in this area, it doesn't prohibit us, I guess, from doing that. Because if there were, then you get rid of one too many trees and bam, they're gone. Ooh, we also have the ship on this side. So the ship, for those of you who do not know, is how you get to another land, i.e. new lands. And we got a chest with some good chunk of money, awesome, awesome. Um, so you pay a lot of money to get that ship going. Ooh, nice. Two chests. And then they push it all the way to the end of the map, and bam. You're free. So since there's no monsters on this side, we can go ahead and give them money, and they will head back to our home with no problems. And damn, that is the third chest right there. And this thing right here, since I've played a little bit before, if you find those, it costs two gold, and you'll get a secret part of the map. And that map, um, you can only use after you either die or you win. So, I believe for the first area, it improves, like, archer abilities, something like that. So they are more accurate. Come on, horse. Come on, let's go. But it, it's very important to get those. Because you're going to be playing this game multiple times. There's no way you can freaking get everything at once. Kind of sucks. Now then. Coming back home. My horse would be tired. Take our time. It's just the beginning. On the road again. Alright, here we go. We're almost there. I recognize this woods. If my horse would stop being so exhausted. He's so fat. Yes, here we go, here we go. Alright, so. I want to get rid of these trees. Because that will help us get more, ooh, thank you, get more, um, rabbits to show up. And the second day is over. Excuse me real quick, I'm going to, uh... Turn down the volume just a smidge. Let's see. Do that music kind of be Yes. Alright, let's see if that helps a little bit. So we want to get rid of these trees as well. The more um, rabbits we get, the better. Since the deer are pretty hard to hit. And our people suck. And you don't lose much since it's one coin to chop it down. And then you get the coin back, so... It's as if nothing ever happened. Now we need to go get the merchant before he doesn't go.
need to make some room so I can pick up the coins that the merchant's going to give me. And go ahead and upgrade this. If we upgrade it all the way, then you would get free. Um, if you hadn't have put a barrier on the other side, you would have gotten a free barrier. But no. The ghosty bitch made us. Ooh, yes. White or black? White or black? I like the black one. Okay, come here. Come here. Alright, black one doesn't want to do it. Maybe? <gasps> yes. Hell yeah. So, I've played all the way to the second island, and that is why I have the horses available. Because I had found the horse perk on top of the, um, shrine. Ah, there you go. This is the archer shrine. So, if you had found it from the first map, which is this one, then this would be the only upgrade you'd be able to get. And on another note, this is the wood shrine. Throw some money in it, and it becomes a stone shrine, which allows you to upgrade at your own. And I like this horse. This horse is badass. Look how far he runs. Damn. Y'all have caught a whole lot. And we should get one more builder because I like having. Wait. To the Stone Age. Do -do -do. All right. So we have fully upgraded in the Wood Age. Next part will be the Stone Age. Yes, all the monies. Which, we need to upgrade that thing on the side. This thing right... Jesus. Right here. This allows an archer to have an archer's post. And it brings some light so we can actually see the baddies that come our way. Oh no, mats! Yes. Now we've upgraded enough that we can have a banker. And that's what this prick right here is. He sits here in his nice little hat. And he waits for you to throw money at him. And then watch his little fat man run, he does. I don't know, let me get a little further. Yeah. And then he puts it inside of your little house. And from there you can get like, I believe it's 10% or something like that. Oh, I probably should have waited. Damn it. I forgot that when you upgrade into the first wood age, you get this part free. So I wasted some money. I'd be dumbs a bit. So right now we're off to a pretty good start. We got our civilization all built up. Got some coins still coming our way. Nice, nice, look at that. And we got most of our structures built. So... Let's see, I kind of want to put a catapult on this side. Because that helps later on in life whenever the big baddies come and destroy your day. Alrighty. I kind of want to go see if I can get some more archers.
Let's head off to that one, um, yes. Let's head off to that one settlement. See if we can get some more people to come our way, join our cause. Made it pretty far before he got tired. I will admit that. Okay. Should be coming up upon it pretty soon, because I remember it was pretty close to the um, ship. That of which we just passed. Oh, here we are. We got two hobos waiting for us. Ba-bam, ba-bam. And they slowly make their way back. But we will surpass them because we are too good and we have a horse. Thy, fit, thy feet shall not touch the ground. Lovely little walk through the woods. You know, everyday stuff. Let's see. Doesn't look like we have enough coin for that one, but that is our next mission, is trying to set that up. Now, another cheap thing we can do is we can try and get these deer back to our place. And the best way to do that is to run when you can make them run and then slow down. That way they don't get behind you Oh, oh, nope. Oh, well, we lost one. We still got four ahead of us. And then when they start running back, come on, run. To stay ahead of them. So they'll run back that way. There we go. Turn around, bitch. You ain't going home today. Cheesy strategy, but some gold. Look at all that. Look at that. Just from taking my time and trying to set that up. Ooh, my overflow. Not too much. Alright, I'll fill him up. As you can see, the money rises a little bit in the back. It's hard to see, but it does. And the rest, we're going to go on back to that boat and get her done. Gotta take my sweet ass time. There we go. So I believe it takes 10 to start the boat. And then you get half the pieces since you're on the first island. And then it's two pieces after that, or two coins per piece after that, I mean. ta -da! And then in a second, we're gonna see some builders running their asses on over here. Maybe. Maybe we're very far away. Oh, there we go. We got one. He's determined. We're gonna try and get this deer over there too and get some more money. Oh no. Oh no. Run. Run. Yes. Okay, now run back. Go. And he's dead. Good bit of coin. We could run back to the boat and try and um, give him more parts, but it's okay to wait. We're in no hurry. And, oh, nope. Before night time. Oh, God. I tried. I got stuck. Every night, the um, little man goes into his little protective house. So, we didn't get to get him this time. Do we have any hobos? Oh, I guess we don't have any useless bastards. 
And now we wait. As you can see, that the catapult just wrecks them. But we are still pretty early. Um, and we need the builders to come back and reset the catapult. But they got other business to do. Important royal businesses. Pretty easy, not bad. For first days. We're on day four. Or, yeah. But, I think it's six actually. I think we might have missed the. No. I don't know. Greek time. Greek days, I mean. Numbers. I used to know them very well. I don't remember if the V is in front of the I. Is it before or after? Because I know the V is a five. And one way it's if it's before, then it's a four. And it's after. I think it's actually a six. Oh, do well. We're making a good chunk of process, anyways. Look at that. The boat is like perfecto. Then another huge chunk of this boat's gonna be done. Nice. I'm gonna save the two just in case. Because we do need to buy another archer. Alright, I saw him pick up a coin, so let's get that. Yes. Alright. They don't have any coins for me. Got one coin. Cheap bastards. He's giving me a coin out of my reserves. And then we got two hobos, so we need two coins. Or three coins, I mean. Oh, there we go. There's the guy that was holding out. There we go. I can give him the rest of the coins. Ah, oh well. We're gonna need them eventually. We got some spooky music going on. Let's see. Now you do not want to be caught out at night, especially if you do not have any coins. The coins are kind of like your life source. So if you are out at night and you see a baddie coming, they will hit you for a coin. And if you're out of coins, you lose your crown. If you don't pick it up before the monster gets it, we're screwed. Oh, so it was four. Because this is the horrible spooky night. It's the red moon. So, we get extra baddies today. Which shouldn't be too bad since we have a horrible army and a catapult. Ain't got nothing on us. Not too bad. Give me my money. Give me the money. Yes. Alright. And he's gonna give us some money too. Alright, so let's run back to the ship. 
We want to get the ship as done, ugh, done as quickly as possible, since that is our way off this hell hole. Sorry, horse. Don't be mad. Thing is right over this bridge. Yep. All right. So it's almost done. I don't have too many pieces left on it. Maybe another day or two and we'll be good. There they go. Off to do their job. Oh hey, nice. Got anything? No? Useless piece of crap. What about you? Oh, good job. Anybody? Nice, nice. Ooh, ooh, yes. Very nice, very nice. So now I don't want to, I don't want to give you money. Not you, give me money. All right, let's get some. Wait. We got, we got bows for days. It looks like. Let me get some more people. Can never have too many archers. Archers are too good. There we go. Batman run. Two coins. Three coins. One coin. Oh, he's going for it. One coin. Go. Be a man. Now give me what you got. <laughs> Two whole coins. Woo! And he's got another one. He can hold on to it. He may keep that one. All right. Another day is a coming. Oh, well. Since it is the day after the red moon, monsters don't come. Huh. Believe it or not, that is true. We can see our old horse again. Hi, bitch. Hi, bitch horse. Hi. Hope you live a wonderful life. All right. Just a heads up on that shrine there. Um, it only works for. Oi, nah. It only works for that day. And up to three days after. Or two days after, I mean. A uh, total of three days. So after that, then they become poopy again. So I really don't like spending money on it because you don't get to keep its benefits. We're bringing deer with us. Gotta stay ahead. Ooh, he's running fast. There we go. Give me that coin. Yeah. Alrighty, I guess let's get our coins and we'll work on the boat again. Anybody, anybody? Got some coin for me? Okay, I'll get my own coin. Alright, so... Let's get this boat done. We might be able to finish it. Maybe. I'm not too sure. Ooh. It's done. 
way earlier than I thought. Alright, while we wait for our people to come get it, let's go get some more hobos. And then I believe it is tin coin, maybe, to throw it into the water. Let's see. Hopefully by now our people's done it. Or at least almost done it. Yeah, I can hear him pounding away on it. Nope. Not pounding away, running. Running across the, the bridge. And we're in. So it takes, I believe, up to three um, builders to push it down the river. And depending on how much terrain, like foresty terrain they have to go through, will determine how fast they push it along. So here we go. All the archers that are on that side come to fight now. Or not fight, but protect the boat. And they kind of kill things along the way. So... There's one more thing that we need now. kind of neat. Oh, look. See, look. Not all the archers left. Some of them stay behind, but not too many. Now, we need to work right here on getting a stone castle. And the stone castle is important because it allows you to build knights, and these knights can also board your ship. Probably should have worked on um, this wall. Wait, run! I didn't work on the wall. Okay. So that's what happens if you don't work on the wall. You get a tad bit screwed. But I want some knights first. We'll build a builder. We need somebody to take over that wall again. Come here, little guy. I need to give you some shit. There we go. There we go. So with their archers. Need some more money as well. Thank you. And then we need, sadly, we need to build some stuff right here. Which I'm hoping we'll be able to do before it becomes spooky outside. So yeah, that's why you kind of need to work on your wall, but I kind of forgot, so. Yeah. So for four gold, you can send the knights out. And they're going to run all the way to your ship and protect it. get rid of that too because that can help us get more um some more coins from the rabbitays but 
The downside of building the large stone castle is it does force your merchant to move all the way to the right. Meaning you won't... Oh, look, here there. I haven't even gotten that far. Um, meaning that... Nice, nice. Meaning that it becomes a bit of a struggle trying to give him that one coin. I'm going to go ahead and recruit these guys. Because we need more archers. But we'll stay with this since it is not... Um, oh, here we go. Um, since it's not too safe back at the home. So as you can see, they just follow with the ship. And if there were mar monsters on this side, they would be the ones to try and protect it. Now, they do have a bit of a ways to go still, so... I guess let's go back and see how... How destroyed our home is. But, we're almost done with this first map. And that's a plus. All right, we've been alive for 10 days. So, yeah, we need to get out of here because a red moon's gonna come on this next shot and it's not gonna be good. I might just let the deer run. I do not want to risk it. Alright, as you can see, they got pretty demolished. And I forgot to give the, uh, the donkey some money. So let's just get a Builder. He can try and rebuild everything, but for right now we're gonna just run. It doesn't really matter what happens to this place, they did. So yeah. We did the bare minimum and we should be able to um, survive as long as they push the boat fast enough we're done I believe it takes takes some amount of coins to send the boat into the um, new world but we got enough coin for that and my horse cannot run damn your horse Maybe someday. All right, now he's not breathing hard. All righty, here we are. Slowly getting there. Got any more monies? No? Bastards. But we're here. Like, look how close we are. We are with this deer. This deer is ours now. The moon is a coming. Shoot the deer. Shoot the deer. Damn. Fuck the deer up. Yeah, three coins. 
And we're back, dear. Any last words? Okay, fuck you too. Hope you die, bitch. Oh, you're back. Oh. Oh, what a shame if, if something were to happen to you. Fuck you, bitch. Alright. They're almost out of the forest and then they'll start pushing a little faster. Alright, so all the workers get in, the knights get in, and we are off. We made it in 11 days. Nice. The big crown is safe. So with that, we can go on to the next spot, which is a spot I have not defeated yet. So let me just head on over there. Anyways, I'm going to stop this right here, guys, before I start. Thank you guys for watching. My name is Maisie of the Maisie Network, and I hope to see you guys again. Y'all have a good day. Alright, bye.